so hi everyone today we'll try to understand what is dimerau's uh, levenstein distance so it's an expanded version of the levenstein distance that we calculate that is used in fuzzy fuzzy ratio library uh, by python so what is dimerau's levenstein distance so if you remember uh, in my previous video i have discussed about what is levenstein distance so it was basically the minimum number of edits required uh, to convert string 1 to string 2 where the three operations possible are insertion removal and replacement now dimerau's levenstein distance we are introducing one more operation that is swap so like look at this particular example a b c d and a c b d so if we go with levenstein distance uh, when we are talking about b c and c b it would be counted as two edits because uh, we would be first replacing b with c and then we would be replacing c with b but eventually if you notice uh, these this can be counted as just one operation if we are able to swap so if uh, bc and cb uh, if uh, cb is getting swapped uh, we call it a one operation so uh, cb would become bc and eventually uh, the edit distance would reduce by one so which uh, in levenstein what, what what was taken as uh, this would, what would have taken as an edit distance of 2 would be now taken as an edit distance of 1 in dimerau's uh, levenstein distance so how would this be performed so uh, this is the particular pseudo code that we would be adding in the levenstein distance code so this is the Levenstein distance code that we have. So one plus minimum of Levenstein distance insertion removal replacement plus the swap operation that I'm telling you uh, in Demerau's Levenstein distance. So there are only four possible operations now. So what does the uh, Demerau's Levenstein distance do? So it's basically one plus x minus uh, last matching index y minus one plus one minus last matching index x minus one plus Levenstein distance string last matching index x minus one. Uh, comma 11 uh, string to last matching index y minus 1 so this plus 1 is already taken in the minimum uh, in this operation plus 1 so we would be uh, eliminate we won't be considering this so this is the entire uh, swap operation that is getting performed where last matching so like for example if we consider two strings a b c d and a c b d and assume that uh, we are at particular we are at index 3 that means uh, we are at c in a b c d and we are at b in acbd so the last matching index y would be the last index in string 2 which has matched with string 1 so as you can see that c has matched with uh, the c in the string 1 so index of uh, c in the second string is 2 so now this last matching index underscore y becomes 2 and similarly last matching index underscore x becomes 1 uh, uh, becomes 2 because for that also last matching index of x is is also b is matching with uh, the index 3 at in the second string in the second string the third index so eventually the last matching index x is 2 b is matching with the third index of with the third uh, with the third element in acbd hence it is also 2 and likewise we will be calculating the entire demerau's levenstein distance uh, equation and uh, the minimum of the four operations would be considered again the whole process like uh, is uh, remains the same in levenstein as we discussed in levenstein distance just one more operation on Swapping gets added.